Hello, this is Farhad and starting with this video, we are going to get acquainted with blockchain technology and cryptocurrency trading through a very detailed and comprehensive course. You may ask that, well, there are many courses, many books, many online videos explaining the whole structure of blockchain technology what are you specifically going to offer new among all of this useful stuff around the internet exactly what shortage in blockchain technology and cryptocurrency trading are you going to compensate well to answer this question we should have a look to all the current educational content about blockchain technology and cryptocurrency trading. The more we look, the more we search on the internet. Unfortunately, the less we find economical approaches on the subject. All the content we find about this financial category are from technical computer-based points of view. One of the most prominent applications of blockchain is in financial sector and surprisingly very few economists have paid attention to this new technology. Blockchain is invented and created by IT men and women and developed by computer programmers and engineers all around the world. So every book, every single book, every video explaining this technology is offered by someone whose proficiency is rooted from computer science. Even if when uh, they are speaking about money, a new form of money called cryptocurrency, even if when they are talking about financial benefits of using blockchain, uh, their perspective is digitalized and computerized. So I, I thought that an uh, economic, especially a capitalistic economic explanation of blockchain technology and the way we deal with cryptocurrencies and investing on them seems very necessary for all the people active on this sector. Each video of this course will have two parts. In part one, we discuss about a concept in blockchain technology or a tool for analyzing crypto assets. And in second part, we analyze the real-time conditions of cryptocurrencies, especially Bitcoin, because Bitcoin is the mother of all cryptocurrencies and try to forecast the behavior of this crypto based on the lessons we have taken before. In each video, we try to offer the material as compact as possible and meanwhile try to keep the integrity and uh, uh, completeness of the subject as far as we can and uh, time allows us. So, each video, including part 1 and 2, will take about 10 to 15 minutes and sometimes 20 minutes at most due to difficulty of the subject. We use many references during the course, which will be mentioned at the end of each course for further reading. Also, for technical analysis, our asset, we use a software by the name of L-Wave, which is a Windows-based software program from Prognosis Software Development Company located in uh, Netherlands and has been specially designed for investors in order to apply Elliott Wave principle after Ralph Nelson Elliott, a guru of the technical analysis of financial markets. Idiot wave theory is a technical analysis tool for forecasting the capital market and sometimes it is regarded as the most 
successful forecasting method ever discovered, which uh, of course is not true, but uh, it can provide very good clues, very good signals for us to take profit from capital markets and decrease lessen or stop the possible loss. During the course, we will have full explanation about Elliott wave theory and how to use Elliott for analyzing our derivative and of course many other technical analysis tools will be explained thoroughly. We have two kinds of analysis. For analyzing the capital market, we have two main tools, fundamental analysis and technical analysis, and uh, we must use both, both of them, technical analysis and fundamental analysis, where we want to try to forecast the direction of movement of any asset in the future. When we want to decide whether we should buy or sell a specific derivative or for our crypto asset, a specific crypto currency, such as Bitcoin, we should learn how to combine fundamental analysis and technical analysis in order to get a buy or sell signal which has the least risk and the most reward. <clears throat> okay, as I mentioned before, our videos have two parts. In part one, we have theory, and in part two, we have an analysis of the digital currency market, specifically Bitcoin, and put the theory we've learned before into the action. After this compact introductory, which covered the first part of our video, let's go to the second part and have a deco at Bitcoin chart and see the circumstances there. Today is Saturday, 22nd of August, 2020. This as you see, is Bitcoin's chart on L-Wave software, which, as I told you before, is a technical analysis software and is going to help us to analyze and forecast the trend of Bitcoin and other digital currencies so that we can decide whether we can enter the market or not. Or if we have entered the market already, whether we can exit the market or not. Alongside using the software and learning how to use this software, we will examine fundamental circumstances to combine with technical ones and derive a buy, sell, uh, hold, or cash position as a combination of our fundamental and technical analysis and put that signal into the work. To have a robust buy or sell signal, first of all, we should consider fundamental situation of our derivative, in this case, Bitcoin. As we'll explain on the next session, almost all fundamental components of Bitcoin suggest an uptrend on its chart. On the Next sessions will examine various fundamental aspects of Bitcoin, such as having or having of Bitcoin network. Uh, is Bitcoin a safe heaven, such as gold and silver, or not for investment? Is Bitcoin's whole space a bubble or not? Is Bitcoin's network very energy consuming or not? Is Bitcoin accepted by government and regulatory authorities? or not, which is a concern of many market participants. Bitcoin network as an intermediary and P2P substitute and many, many other factors which can help us make a complete or 
complete as far as we can have perspective of the whole Bitcoin space. After gaining a fundamental perspective and finding the most probable expected trend of a derivative, we come to technical analysis to find the best points of entry or exit of our position. In this case about our chart of Bitcoin, suppose that we have investigated all fundamental factors of Bitcoin and have reached to this conclusion that the overall movement of Bitcoin is expected to be upward. Well, now we should look at our chart with technical point of view and decide whether we can open a buy position today or not. If we look at our chart, in L wave or Elliott wave theory, we need three consecutive trends up or down to decide to enter the market or not. As you can see on our chart on summary inspector, today we have only two consecutive trends up. One trend up and two trend up. So we'd better not enter the market today. That's it. As you can see, the price of the Bitcoin is about 11,500, or to be exact, uh, as our chart is real time, $11,556. And our expert advisor on L Wave has the same opinion, as you can see. Only two consecutive trends are up and most conservative targets are already reached. This is the opinion of our expert advisor. If you know Persian, you can see my Persian version of these videos on which we have reached to part uh, 39 and we've earned more than 2,500 pips up to now and see that most of the conservative targets which are which are mentioned here in our expert advisor are already come to truth and have made us a lot of profit yet our expert advisor continues the analysis by sentence that the more wave degrees get in line and turn up the higher the probabilities so for today, we won't have any open positions because we don't have three consecutive trends up or down. And we should wait in ambush to find the best opportunity to tag the market on the proper time. Until the next session, goodbye.